It's called an American Kestrel. And I've worked with a bunch of males, that's what he is. And I'm always confused as to how they can actually survive out in the wild. Because all the male Kestrels I've worked with have all been just so lovely and sweet. But I think what it is, is the Kestrels that um, I get in captivity are all Kestrels from more urban areas and they're used to seeing people. So. Is it just a baby? Full size adult. Just a small falcon, that's it. What do they eat? Um, mice, other birds and insects. They'll eat snakes in warmer parts of the climate. They'll eat lizards. Mostly stuff they find in an open field. And so he has, he does a really good job of this if I can get him to focus on something. So, um, so those of you that were here with the owl, one of the things I said is that their eyes don't move. Well, for the daytime birds of prey, their eyes move only just two degrees. And so when they focus on things and they want to stay focused on it, um, you can move their body around and their head stays still. Mm. It's called gyrating. <laughs> Let's see. Looks like he's dancing. Looks like he's dancing, yeah. Way better dancer than I am. I'm definitely um, the worker in this scenario. Yeah. That's definitely my job. I'm a talking, cleaning perch. That's what I am. I mean, hey, as long as you're okay with it. Yeah. But I'm super glad to see that here. Yeah. Because that's a lot to wipe up. So I have, um, we have measured it um, when the eagle goes to the bathroom one time, and she, we measured almost seven feet. Right? That's what they It's something. One, two, three. Up. Oh. Wow. There you go. Can you do it one more time? Yes. You, you ready? One, two, and I'll, I'll do it here, and then I'll face this direction. Okay, thanks. So everyone will get a chance with a head on shot. You ready? One, two, three. Up. Oh. Up. Got to be fast. Shutter. Okay. Everybody hold your button down. Just hold ready? your button down, yeah. guys. I'm going to turn it off with me. One, two, three. Up. Oh. 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 That was very great. The bird just looks like it's so bad. So I'm going to get these two right here, and then I'll get you, okay? Okay. Yep. All right. Come on, Thomas. Stand right here. Look at my heart. This kid is so cute. Okay. Do you want to get into it and hold it so you guys can take it? <laughs> but the funny thing is now my left hand is strong. Okay. Yep. Yeah. All right, are you next? Yeah. And then you'll be next. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. You know what, though? We get pets so we can learn how to take care of things, right? And sometimes we do good, and sometimes we still have more to learn. You get all of them. All right. There you go. There you go. Okay. Switch. No here. Okay. All right, so you guys line right up in front of me. Can you do two? Oh, sure. Yeah, I'll be on, I'll be on your side. Yeah, yeah she'll side. That's good. Okay. All right, there we go. Come on, Junior. Come on, Jack. Oh, yeah. yeah this is awesome. Everyone look forward to the bird. 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 All right, let's go. There we go. Okay, we're going to get these three next. And then we put this bird away and get the owl out. How heavy is she? She's about four pounds. Oh wow. Yeah. Look like and by so by size. She's the one you would put your finger in. And yeah, yeah. Um, by size, she is the strongest raptor in the United States that's been studied. So what I mean by that is her feet, the squeezing power of her feet, oh. is about 300 pounds per square inch, wow. equal yeah. to that of the bald eagle. She has big feet. Yeah. She has very big feet. They're huge. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Who eats the owl as an adult? Yeah. Nobody. Nothing. Nothing. Once they fly, 
Um, it has a great term. Ready? We call them an apex predator. <laughs> They're the at the top. The top. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, they're one of their biggest um, competition in areas like this is the bald eagle and the red-tailed hawk because great horned owls don't make their own nests. They steal them. Oh, yeah. Yes. All right. Your turn now? So that's what that's all. She was told. It's time. Like, like weaning off the binky. You don't need the binky anymore. Another thing that's not a deterrent, but in conflict, is outdoor cats. No, we don't. Yeah. So that's, you know, because for the babies... Our dog is so used to the birds and the owls. You know, some dogs aren't interested. Other dogs are.